Hello my viewers. I had an exhaust fan motor uh, go bad on me and uh, I went ahead and this, this is the motor I put in it and I want to show you something that there's certain things that make uh, a good replacement motor a good replacement motor and you know if you cannot get the uh, OEM motor or let's say for example it's too darn expensive or something uh, take a look at this this is I already put this motor on this on this bracket here anyway and it's gonna work out good uh, now there's certain things that matter here okay of course RPM is one item uh, now this one here says 120 horsepower but take a look at the original motor Ow, son of a now take a look at this original motor here okay and the original motor here okay the information that's pertinent here really okay it's 115 volts and as you can see this does not have the horsepower or RPM but the thing that makes that, that you really need to go by anyway is the amount of amps that this motor is going to draw which is 1.7 and that right there in itself is what made this motor a good replacement motor is the fact that the see the, the amp draw uh, 1.7 is still the same now um, there are certain differences with this motor which is not a big deal uh, one, okay, the uh, shaft size. Let me see if I can show you the difference. Uh, the body size is a little bit different too. Uh, the original motor is slightly uh, shorter, okay, by maybe about half of an inch or so. And meaning this uh, this one's longer. The shaft is actually much longer on the replacement motor than uh, right here in the original. Uh, let me see if I can sort of uh, show you what I mean. It's kind of hard to get these. Well, anyway, see, so you can kind of tell that the original has a shorter shaft, but that's not a problem because once I get the blower wheel uh, on here, I can just cut the shaft and nobody will be the wiser. So, I mean, this motor is going to work just fine, just the same way as if I went out and got an OEM motor and this OEM motor right here is probably kind of pricey anyway where I had this one just rolling around my truck anyway so instead of spending that extra money on a, on another motor just use what I got um, that in itself too is a another thing that uh, makes a tech a tech or, or separates the techs from the uh, parts changers out there okay or parts monkeys whatever you want to call it um, now never mind the fact that both of these are FASCO motors I mean that that right there didn't uh, sway me in the least bit as far as choosing uh, this motor as a replacement like I said it was uh, well shaft uh, diameter of course which is 5 16 and that was a major thing because I didn't want to have to uh, get a, a whole different uh, blower wheel, which I had to anyway, but the replacement blower wheel is not going to be too difficult to get a hold of anyway. Um, so, I just wanted to show that. 